it's tough. Mentally, it's tough because um, the final two weeks are supposed to be feeling comfortable, seeing results, and I am here. You know, I'm I'm seeing what I want to see, but I could have been doing a lot better. But taking into consideration how the beginning of the year started, it was rough, and now I'm trying to play catch up with the other athletes who have things basically put in place for them. But um, I'm a fighter, so I, I go. I will go there and do my best. Mr. Stewart spoke with TV6 Sport during his training sessions at the Dwight York Stadium in Tobago. He said at one time he was on the verge of giving up. And facilitate me on days, even when that sports camp does still allow me to come and train, and I really appreciate that. I guess that's the reason why I will continue this season. So I must say special thanks to them and um, my coach with Franklin, you know, to stick it out with me because sometimes I come training. And I, say, I tell any honest truth, without him, I don't think I'd have continued the sport because I was literally on the verge of giving up track and field. Mr. Stewart said those in authority need to listen to the cries of athletes. Current people right now, they just try to facilitate us to the best of their ability, but I think the higher heads need to come out and listen, hear the athletes and their voice. Sometimes we need to talk to somebody who will really understand us better. You know, but um, so far coming to the stadium, I must say a special thanks to Mr. Tobias and the stadium staff because they uh, try their best to help me out. Elizabeth Williams, TV6 Sport.